drinking a little too much But I don't wanna feel how I felt before Running back to you, I'm running back to you And I don't wanna feel how I felt before Running back to you, I'm running back to you Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel So today we have a wig from Extra in Hair This is a hair store on Amazon they reached out to me see if i wanted to do a collab with them i said yeah of course so yeah this is a 40 inch wig you guys know that i'm mad short od so me with a 40 inch wig is like crazy this came down to literally like my thigh almost my knee but you know this is good for a special occasion or whatever i'm showing you guys how long the hair really really is i guess when you like six feet or something like that you'll be able to pull this off but yeah i can too but i would definitely cut it when wearing it outside so yeah i'm gonna show you the hair this is the parting space it's a five by five you know part that goes all the way back i was checking to see if it was like a cross just like you know the five by five closures but it was not it was just all the way back so the long parting gives like a more realistic look um i had a, like a little bonnet wig cap under there so yeah i'm just gonna go through here and just finger comb the sections as i go along just to get any tangles out i wanted to do crimps but you'll see how that works out it says 100 percent heat resistant but you'll also see how that works out <laughs> and um yeah what i like about this wig is that it does not like look synthetic like it does not give off that plastic synthetic look to me this is all the hair details the pricing everything like that everything you need to know about the wig the hair company the amazon vendor etc etc so yeah like i said this does not look synthetic like when you look at it you can't say oh yeah that's synthetic like right off the bat that's what i really like about it um they said they like use syn like, not synthetic fibers but realistic fibers or something like that but yeah that's how long the wig is percent heat resistant so i'm assuming that means that i can put heat on her because i'm gonna do some crimps because i don't know the waves are not doing it for me so i'm just gonna do that and i'm just gonna finger comb it through because i don't really want to use a comb or anything like that so I'm just gonna do that i'm just gonna rub it through that's what i'm gonna do rub it through and yeah, this is everything I got a crimp right here. The waves don't look that bad. I'm not gonna say they look bad, but you know, during shipping, they start to get a little, you know, messed up. All right, so I got my crimp right here. We're gonna do like a little test strand just to see if it burns towards the end. I can always cut that off. <laughs> so let me check. work out guys this may not work out i feel like this hair you could probably just braid and call it a day and keep it in the braids because i don't know this crepper stuff doesn't work then i'm actually not getting any shedding that's a little crazy yeah my little bit boy decided to be loud when i'm filming is it not ironic guys it is i know but anyway while we wait for this to cool down a bit, get into this five, it says five by five, but it's five inches of parting space. And I just have a wig cap underneath here. Like I always, not actually a wig cap, it's like a little bonnet I got. But anyway, yeah, you can see the parting space. So yeah, it looks good. You see all her, all her, you see her in her 40 inches of glory. <laughs> like this is really like true stripper hair. I don't know, I might not even do the um, crimps. We don't see because I don't know. It's not looking good over here for the crimps. I would, if I was you, let me see. I think I'm getting no, no, no. I got a few little strands. I don't know if you can see that. If I was you, I probably would honestly just maybe wet this hair with some mousse or put some mousse in it and then just braid it. Oh, what idea number two? I'm gonna put some mousse in that lot of body mousse real quick and see what we get from there because i don't know to be honest with you guys okay okay it's kind of you know the 
finding myself. I'm gonna have black hair on the floor like crazy. All right, anyway, let's just put the mousse up here. How was y'all doing today? Good, mine just busy. I sold some stuff on my Depop. Go check out my Depop. I sold two pair of jeans to the same person or whatever. Shipped it out same day. Usually my shipping is same day if you guys want it. Oh, she was falling. <laughs> if you guys want to know. I'm going to have to use a lot of mousse. I don't even want to use all my mousse, but whatever. I need to get these curls popping. The only thing with synthetic hair is that, like, it's so involving, you know? So far, we're looking okay. It looks less frizzy. What do you guys think? Fun fact, my edges are done because I got a wig under here that I just got installed yesterday, so stay tuned for that video. I did a whole wig transformation on that hair, not sponsored, bought it with my own money, sis, yes. But the hair color came out fire, like, I think that's the best hair color I ever did on any hair that I've had. Even the hairdresser said it, she kept asking me, like, what colors I use to tone or whatever and everything like that, so... Even though it was fire. But y'all gonna see it. Stay tuned for that. Oh, she's doing the job. Okay. So, get your moves out. Get your moves out. Don't we'll find put too much moves, but it should be alright. It should be alright. And as you go along, you should scrunch. So, you know, the hair will have some, like, texture, body to it or whatever. The hair, though feels nice I, I can't even lie to you for this to be synthetic hair this hair feels nice like this would be like a wig like you going out for your birthday it's some type of special occasion wig like this ain't no regular day wig you know what i'm saying like not at all yeah. let me finish doing this and i'm gonna come back and show you the end all right y'all that's how we looking that's how we looking that's how we coming that's the um don't mind my shoes <laughs> That's how the wig came out or whatever. These are the curls. All 40 inches of them. Don't mind my floor. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. That's how we looking. That's how we coming. So yeah, let me turn her around. That's how she looking, right? Right? We got the wet little look going on here. I just put a bunch of mousse in it. I know what else I could put. They said oil on the website, but I don't know. I didn't want to weigh it down. The oil I have is super heavy. This is the parting space goes all the way back five by five but it's not five by five across it's just five by five back so they tricked me with that one we're gonna shift the part you know the middle part i mean sorry side part like i always do so stay tuned here y'all got an egghead i got the wig on <laughs> but anyway you see my big old forehead but yeah you see a line of demarcation i don't know my cap slipped back a little bit i had a hard time getting this wig. i look like an alien for real a hard time getting this wig i'm gonna stand up for you real quick so you can see how long we um coming with this 40 inches. I might keep it in the middle part because this wig is a little small for me. Not small, but I do have my other wig in. So that's the issue. And I am getting a bit of tangling at the moment, but that's to be, this is all the way down to like my legs right now. But you know, you would have to separate these or whatever just so it won't be so much tangling. The hair don't have a lot of tangling, but it is getting like snaggy, but you know it's 40 inches, so yeah. I'm about to cut this lace real quick. I still bet I have a really messed up bed over there. And I'm not tacking this down, obviously, because I do have another wig under here. I know wig on top of a wig, but you gotta do what you gotta do, right? I was hoping this wig came before I got my hair done, but it just didn't work out that way. I want to leave some lace here because you need something to like hold. I'm sitting on this hair right now, like, and we know I'm short. So if you like six feet, you can manage this hair. You can, you really can. I'm not going to cut in the camera, but I'm looking at the mirror. You really can manage this hair. I want to leave some lace or whatever because sometimes I cut too close to the hairline and stuff 
I don't know, these wigs, I don't be cutting no ear tabs. I just try to tuck it or whatever. And you can see my wig. Yeah, I'm gonna leave like that much lace. Here I go, trying not to tangle the wig. Cut this lace off. I hope they make one day like wigs that already got the lace cut. Just give us a little tiny bit to cut, just to customize. And then yeah, because this is like the hardest part to me. This and the baby hairs. Oh Lord, I don't know. Yeah, I left that little piece right there. I guess that's fine. But anyway, but you know that would be tapped down. But right now, you don't know, see, because it's covered. This is why I wear middle parts, because my forehead's so big, you see? I might have to cut some more lace. I don't know. Well, maybe not. Maybe I'll just spray some gotta be real quick. So it could like come and then take the comb. But you can't really tell. Yeah, that's fine. Look at my forehead though, like <laughs> I can't get over my forehead. Oh my god. And this is why I don't do middle parts. Can y'all see me? Can y'all see me? No, you can't. Look at the hair. Look at where it's at on me. On my thigh. This is like that Nicki Minaj. Oh, my dirty room to my legs. All right, anyway, <laughs> this is what I came up with. This would be real fire, like on the beach, if you was on vacation or whatever with a bathing suit on. And you can take pictures. Look at the back. Let me try to show y'all the back. Oh, <laughs> look at the back. Ain't that crazy? Don't mind my neighbors. They act retarded. But anyway, yeah, that's the back. I'm five foot one, five foot two. But yeah, I will obviously cut this wig probably to like about here because this is just too long for me but people do wear their hair this long but anyway that's how i'm looking that's how i'm coming with this little rapunzel look um, i had to clean my mirror so hopefully you guys can see me you're really gonna have to finger comb this wig out or just basically don't touch it so i basically have mine like to the side i don't know if you guys can see like that but you could do the little tuck behind the ear thing if you got your edges done or whatever can't do it <laughs> the little tuck behind the hair thing like that but yeah that's how we're looking so just the wig 40 inches all the details are down below and let's look at the wave pattern up close yeah, you see? so yeah that's the wave pattern like i said this hair will get a bit tangly but you just have to keep finger combing it to make it look good it's ex it's extensive <laughs> It's synthetic, as you guys know. But yeah, that's how I'm looking. That's how I'm coming. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Any questions, leave them down below. And I use mousse for this hair and nothing else but mousse. So yeah, I know it's too long for me. Obviously, I'm going to cut it, like I said, to like up here or whatever. Because I like the waves or whatever. This will look cute. And that's the texture. Don't mind my room. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.